hey guys, it's Steel from Woodland Airsoft, and I'm coming back with a review of all the attack attachments on my Stinger R39. Hi, this is Jeff from Woodland Ops Airsoft, and um, this is the M80, the Double Eagle M83. Hey guys, it's Steel from Woodland Airsoft, and I'm doing a review of the Smith and Wesson. All right, this is Steel from Woodland Airsoft, and I'm doing a review of my Rap4 Woodland BDU camo jacket. Hey guys, it's Steel from Woodland Airsoft, and I'm doing a quick tips and. A how to clear a room with one person. Hi, this is Drew from Woodland Ops Airsoft, and uh, <coughs> this is my Sly Paintball slash Airsoft chest protector, which I like because it's like Tempur-Pedic foam kind of thing. It's nice and squishy, and um, it fits me pretty well, and it's nice and thin, so it breathes really well, has breathing areas. It doesn't really have pr protection next to the neck that much, but it has protection everywhere else. And, um, for paintball, it's supposed to let the paintball bounce off of you, so you won't get hit. And with airsoft, it bounces off and you barely even feel it. And, um, you can see the back. This is small slash medium. So, it says sly equipment. It's got back padding as well. And, uh, it's really good quality. I got this for about 50 bucks at, uh, Extreme Velocity Paintball. And, um, again, it's a birthday gift. So... Yeah, this is a, really I recommend this to paintballers or airsofters, as well as the proto gloves, which if you haven't seen that video, it's in our channel. Yeah. And uh, it's really comfortable, and um, so yeah, I just recommend it to everyone, and if you have a spare 50 bucks, I suggest you spend it on this. So yeah, please subscribe and comment. Thanks.